we're talking about text and titles in this video, y'all. All right, so um, let's say you want to add you some text, you know, add you a little text that pop up for your viewers to read on your screen, or if you want to tell them, hey, follow me, whatever you want to say on your video, you can put whatever you want to put on your video, okay? So Apple, once again, they have titles. They consider it titles, text, whatever you want to call it, already built into their software. All right, so say if you know how some people put, like, we're going to, since we're doing a video, we're going to add like say if you wanted to do we're gonna do this one called clouds right so say if this is the beginning of our video and we want people to know who we are or to follow us we're gonna drop this in the beginning of our video right so i just clicked on it and bring it you just bring it down to your timeline okay all right so now as you can see this little purple this little purple part right here is your text, it's your title. So what you do is while you have it open, you can double click on it so we can come in here and we wanna type what we want to say. So after you put it into your timeline, you wanna double click on it and we're gonna come over here. So over here we have, inside this window, we have all of our different fonts. With Apple, you there is a way that you can download and import your own fonts, but I do believe that they have some really nice, they have some really nice fonts that's already built in. You have your, of course, you know how you wanna align it, what size you may want. This like is kinda, it's grayed out, so you may not be able to change the size for this one, but there is a way you can change the size for other ones. It just depends. Um, then you have your bold, italic, and this is like an outline. So we don't want none of that. We're gonna take that off, but you can just play around with it. Remember, when you start using products when you start learning new things you want to play around with it just play around test it out see what works see what don't don't be intimidated by the software and that's what i think a lot of people do they get intimidated do not be intimidated play around make mistakes if you have to there's ways that you can redo on apple okay this is something i did not mention but there is a way that you can redo or undo um, right here, if you go up here at the top and hit edit, you can do undo changes, or you can, as I always mention to y'all about the keyboard shortcuts, you can hit command Z to undo anything that you might've changed. Okay. So click on here and we want to say, we're going to say our name is tech Bay B. We're going to put tech Bay B in there for our description. We can do our movie tutorial. All right. So say if we want to change the color, we can select that. And then we got our little color, color wheel down here. I think I'm gonna go with pink. So just select what color you want, then close it. And if you unselect your text, you now have um, iMovie in pink and then Tech Baby in white. Yeah, I wanna change the color Tech Baby. We are gonna double click. Let's change that color to, uh, yeah, we'll go with this. All right, so now we're gonna hit play. Now you see that? Now, say if you want it to be up there a little bit longer, you can drag this over and this will determine how long it's gonna be on your clip. <laughs> All right, y'all, so we just finished eating. That was delicious, look at the boy. <laughs> All right, so now say if we wanna add some more text, we're gonna add another little text up in here. Say if we wanna do, and as you can see, one thing about their text features, they do something, like they have, all of them are kind of animated, so like they, they may split, they may slide in, they may pop up in the lower third, uh, they may reveal, they may, it just depends on, it'll tell you what it's gonna do, but even if, it, if you don't understand, like this one say gravity, if you don't understand what it's doing, you could just add it and then play it and see if you like how, how it comes into your video. All right, so I just did this split one and we are gonna just say, uh, he is funny. All right, we're gonna say he is funny. Now let's say we wanna add an emoji. Let's say we wanna get fancy and add an emoji. We about to do our keyboard shortcut, shortcut. We're gonna hit Command, Control, and then Space. So that's Command, Control, and then Space. And then let's say we add this emoji. Boom. So now we have, he is funny. We have it playing for four seconds. As you see, it shows you how long it plays. If you want to trim it down, remember you take it, you trim, you can trim it down. So you drag it and move it from left to right. That's going to determine how long that text is going to play. So we're going to hit play. 
Now you see how it came in? He is funny. All right, so let's say, remember, we just only want to do an emoji. So we gon' we'll go with, we'll go with slide. We'll go with slide. Say we only want to do an emoji. We just import, we just double click on slide. It's in there. We're going to double click down here inside the purple. We're going to hit what I tell you, command, control, space. Um, and then we'll add a heart. All right, so... Now let's hit play. Now you see how they just float, float up there and then it disappears. So this is how you can add text and titles to your video content, play around with it, see what you like, see what you don't like. Apple has, that's what I do love about Apple. They have their own in, you know, they do have their text and type, their titles already built into the software. So you don't have to worry about going out to try to find it. You can use everything right here. So thank y'all so much for watching. Make sure you check the description box below where I like to add any resources that I feel are useful for you. And remember until next time, do not stress because with Tech Baby, you will become the best. Bye.